In the last video, you learned how to use our builder to create your first Hayflow. In this video, we'll give you an overview of all other sections of our tool, such as integrations, analytics, design, and the response dashboard. My name is Franci, and welcome to Hayflow. First, let's have a look at our left side navigation panel. Here we'll find the blocks and editing tab that you've seen in our first video, as well as the design and the code tab. In this video, we want to give you a quick overview of Hayflow, so we're not going to go into much detail about every section, but we'll link to dedicated tutorial videos instead. In the design tab, you can define the general style of your Hayflow, including the primary colors, fonts, and block appearance. You can reveal more design settings if you switch from essential to expert mode. Check out our design basics video to learn more about this section. While Hayflow is a no-code tool, there is also an option to add CSS or JavaScript via the code tab. Let's continue with our top navigation panel. After you've built your Hayflow, you can integrate it with your favorite tools. We offer a variety of different integration options, such as response handlers or analytics tools. If you want to learn more about these, head to our integrations video. Next up is our built-in analytics dashboard, which gives you insights about your Hayflow's performance without having to integrate with a third-party tool like Google Analytics. Click on the video suggestion above to learn more about this dashboard and other analytics options. The response dashboard lets you see all replies to your Hayflow and offers advanced filters so you can focus on the most relevant information. Lastly, we have our Hayflow settings. Here you can adjust the name and language of your Hayflow or upload a preview image and get a QR code to share your flow. Here you'll also find advanced settings for user behavior, like enforcing single submit or restoring data, as well as tracking options, upload settings, and backups of your Hayflow. Click on the Hayflow logo in the top left corner to get back to the main menu. Here you can see all your Hayflows and create folders to keep a better overview. Right-click on a Hayflow to duplicate or delete it, or for quick access to its responses, analytics dashboard, or settings. Click on your credentials in the top right corner to change your account settings like language, password, or plan, See your invoices or access our help center that includes detailed information about all functionalities, recently released features, and general best practices. Congratulations, now you know how to navigate through Hayflow. Check out our other tutorials to learn more about our core features and integrations. Happy building and have a great day.